the Canvas inbox tool is a really nice way to communicate with your students, especially because they might not be checking their email all the time. Chances are they're going to be using Canvas for classes. They're going to see if they have new notifications. To have access your inbox, you can use global navigation screen and go to inbox. And here you're going to see any messages that you have received. You can organize these by uh, your class, any class that you have. So if you want to see any message that you have pertaining to a specific section, um, you can go ahead and check there. Uh, otherwise, you can organize these by just everything that you have. Inbox are unread. You can star items if you want to come back them, archive them, and etc. To create a new message, you're going to compose a message. And um, you can, again, go ahead and put this in that you want to um, put a message to a entire class. If you'd rather just go to a specific person, um, you can now go and just put a person in and send them a message. That way you don't have to go through classes all the time anymore. Uh, I'm going to say... I want to send a message to um, this people in this class. Um, you can send it as an individual message so they all get it. Or if you leave this un unchecked, it's going to send it to the um, whole group. And the whole group will see um, and can respond to everyone in there. Um, here, in this box, I can decide that I want to um, maybe send it to teachers, or maybe if I just want to look and see which students I have. Um, it's going to give me a list of students. So I could go send it to all students, um, or I could hold down my control button and select specific ones. Um, then I'm just going to put in your message. You're done. Um, you can add an attachment. So if you have a file that you want to grab from your computer, uh, you could go ahead and put one of those in there. So here's a picture. Uh, if you would rather um, record an audio file, um, you can go ahead and click record. And there's me in my living room. Uh, just click start recording and it would put in that file for you. Um, when you're done, you're going to, I'll just send this to Guile, you'll like that. Uh, you just click send, and then that's going to be a pretty straightforward way to send messages in your Canvas inbox. Uh, one other thing that's really nice is if you go into a gradebook for one of your classes, and you see that a student, or you want to um, message students maybe who didn't turn in an assignment, uh, you can click on that assignment, click on the three dots, go to message students who, um, who have submitted, uh, who have not submitted. So you just want to send a message. Um, so if they're excused, you can skip them. But you can just say, hey, I forgot to turn this in. Make sure you get it in by this date. Send it to them. And then all students who have not turned in that assignment uh, will get a message from you about uh, getting that done. So uh, the inbox tool is a really nice way to communicate with your students.